Hello, space explorers. Today is September 13th, 2025, and we have some incredibly exciting news from the final frontier. The James Webb Space Telescope, or JWS, is humanity's most powerful telescope, launched in 2021 to peer deeper into the cosmos than ever before. Its giant golden mirror, over 21 feet wide, lets it see the first stars and galaxies, study planet formation, and even search for signs of life. Webb orbits a million miles from Earth at the second Lagrange point, where it stays cold and stable, shielded from the sun's heat. This allows it to see in infrared, revealing cosmic secrets hidden from other telescopes. Already, Webb has shown us swirling galaxies, newborn stars, and the atmospheres of distant exoplanets. Every image and discovery brings us closer to answering the biggest questions. Where did we come from? How did the universe begin? Are we alone? Now let's talk about a special object Webb recently observed, a comet named 3i Atlas. The I stands for interstellar. This comet is a visitor from another star system, traveling for millions of years before entering our solar system. Discovered in December 2019 by the Atlas Survey in Hawaii, 3i Atlas is only the third confirmed interstellar object we've found. These rare visitors are cosmic messengers, carrying clues about the chemistry and building blocks of other star systems. When first spotted, 3i Atlas was surrounded by a huge, bright coma, a cloud of gas and dust, making it hard to see its solid core. Scientists were eager to know the size of its nucleus, which could reveal its origins and composition. But the coma's glare made measuring the nucleus nearly impossible, even with Hubble. Only a tool powerful enough to cut through the fog could solve the mystery. That's where the James Webb Space Telescope came in, ready to reveal the heart of this interstellar traveler. Webb's unique capabilities would finally let us see what was hidden inside. How did Webb study this elusive visitor? By using its incredible infrared vision. As 3i Atlas neared the sun, it glowed brightly in infrared, perfect for Webb's sensitive instruments. The science team carefully tracked the comet's path and pointed Webb's giant mirror at the exact spot in the sky. Webb's near-infrared camera, NERCAM, and mid-infrared instrument, MIRI, could distinguish the faint heat of the nucleus from the bright coma. Instead of a simple photo, Webb collected complex data on the comet's brightness at different wavelengths. Scientists built computer models to simulate what Webb should see for different nucleus sizes, then matched the real data to these models. This let them separate the nucleus's light from the surrounding dust, like spotting a person in a thick fog with thermal goggles. Time was short. 3i Atlas was already heading back into interstellar space, never to return. Thanks to Webb's speed and precision, we captured a close-up look before our visitor disappeared. This was a rare, fleeting chance to study a piece of another solar system. Webb delivered just in time. So what did Webb discover? The nucleus of 3i Atlas is shockingly tiny, just about 200 meters across, the length of two football fields. This was a huge surprise. Its bright, massive coma had led scientists to expect a much larger core. Instead, Webb revealed that even a small nucleus can create a spectacular display if it's made of volatile ices that vaporize easily. 3i Atlas was a tiny rock putting on a big show, challenging our assumptions about interstellar comets. This finding tells us that the comet's home system may have produced many small, active bodies. It's a powerful reminder. Direct observation can overturn years of educated guesses. Without Webb, we'd still believe 3i Atlas was much larger. Now, we know its true size, and that changes everything about how we think of interstellar visitors. Sometimes, the universe's biggest surprises come in the smallest packages. Before Webb, scientists could only guess the size of 3i Atlas's nucleus, estimating it at 1 to 4 kilometers wide based on its brightness and coma. But visible and ultraviolet telescopes like Hubble couldn't see through the glare. Measuring the nucleus was like spotting a firefly on a searchlight. Models and indirect methods left a lot of uncertainty. Webb's infrared vision changed everything. By measuring the heat signature of the nucleus, Webb provided a direct, precise measurement, just 200 meters. This leap from guesswork to hard fact is what science is all about. New technology replacing assumptions with evidence. Webb turned a fuzzy question mark into a solid number. It's not just a win for comet science, but a demonstration of how new tools revolutionize our understanding of the universe. With Webb, we're no longer guessing, we're measuring. And that's how real progress happens. What made this discovery possible? 
Webb's two superpowers, sensitivity to infrared light and incredible resolution. Even cold objects like comet nuclei emit infrared heat, and Webb's instruments can detect it with stunning precision. Its giant mirror collects more light and delivers sharper images, letting scientists separate the tiny nucleus from the bright coma. NIRCAM and MIRI work together. NIRCAM for sharp images, MIRI for measuring heat. By combining their data, scientists built a complete thermal profile and confidently measured the nucleus's size. This teamwork of instruments is what sets Webb apart from older telescopes. Webb isn't just bigger, it's a new kind of observatory, opening a new window on the universe. For the first time, we can see and measure what was once invisible. The discovery of 3i slash Atlas's tiny core is just the beginning. With Webb, we're seeing the unseen and rewriting what we know about the cosmos. Why does the size of one little comet matter? Because in space, size reveals secrets about how planetary systems form. Comets are cosmic fossils, preserving the original ingredients of their home systems. The survival of such a small object on a journey through interstellar space is remarkable, and suggests other systems may produce many small bodies. If most interstellar comets are tiny, there could be far more of them passing through our solar system than we realized. New telescopes may soon reveal a whole stream of these messengers, each with clues about distant worlds. This knowledge is vital for future exploration, Knowing what comets are made of helps us plan missions and even consider mining them for resources. The discovery that a tiny nucleus can be so active is crucial for mission planners. Every new fact, no matter how small, adds to our cosmic roadmap. In space, even the smallest discoveries can have huge implications. The story of 3i slash Atlas and Webb is a perfect example of why we explore, we ask questions, and the universe surprises us. We thought we'd found a medium-sized comet, but discovered a tiny, hyperactive ice ball, reshaping our understanding of interstellar objects. This is science in action, a mystery, a new tool, a surprising answer, and new questions to chase. The universe is more complex and surprising than we imagine, and discoveries like this push us to rethink what's possible. 3i slash Atlas connects us to the galaxy, reminding us we're part of a vast cosmic neighborhood. Thanks to Webb, we can finally greet these visitors and learn their secrets. What other surprises are out there? The only way to know is to keep looking up. Let this discovery spark your curiosity. The universe is full of mysteries waiting to be solved. With tools like Webb, we're living in a golden age of discovery. The adventure is just beginning, so keep wondering and never lose your sense of awe.